Okay, guys, here we are with the seniors. Very old senior there. I think 35 years old is Henry Fonda. Got Matlock and Pistol. Anyhow, sorry about that. These guys have not been out for a while because this public arena has been locked for a long time and they're still trying to commandeer it to a special interest group, Sunnyside Saddle Club, and I'm going around around with the city of Chula Vista, who is a smart city, trying to, um, I keep doing that, Trying, they're trying to lock this facility up and keep the public out. And um, because they got some special interest group that are taking the public arenas, sadly. I see a lot of, a lot of um, people are taking, it's just like they're commandeering the trails, they're doing all kinds of naughty stuff. So anyhow, I'm just kind of giving a little quick update about um, the arena. There's a special small club that wants to kind of grab the arena from public use, which we've had for over 20 plus years. And, um, you know, when you lock up horses for a while, it can be actually dangerous. Like, I wouldn't want to get on and ride anyone right now just because they're all full of themselves because they haven't been out to run. Anyhow, Henry's super old, nice oh, super old guy. Okay, I'm just giving an update. I'll put more information in this because it's kind of ridiculous. They, um, there's, I'm being told that you have to FOIA the request for their contracts or agreements with the special club that says that they're a nonprofit organization, but yet I have zero, they can't find any record of it. And um, I've even called or contacted the state, yeah, I called them uh, two days ago, and they had zero record of these people being nonprofit. Yeah, I'd like to get on that, huh? So, and, and then you hear different, different explanations from different people at the city. Oh, and um, the Roar Park, they're the ones who contacted the Chamber of Commerce, um, Chamber of Commerce, and told me they black, they black balled me. Anyhow, so all right, you guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. I hear dogs barking in the background. Hold on to your public lands, that's all I'm saying. Try to make sure people keep those open. Okay, guys. Be good. We'll talk to you later. <laughs> You're okay. <laughs> See, so and I, if, if you lock out the public from allowing your horses to run around, the public doesn't get to enjoy them. See that? And I like the fact that they can enjoy the horses. All right. I, I'll give you a fuller, more full, complete story about this later, guys. Take care.